In New York, we have a caution flag, and uh, we're focusing on it and trying to understand exactly what has happened. Well, those were some concerning words from Governor Cuomo today about our region and the number of COVID-19 cases that is steadily increasing. Today, the Western New York region posted the highest rate in the state for the fourth straight day. And one of the places the governor says is part of this case increase is a food processing plant in Chautauqua County. Tonight, two on your sides, Leanne Stuck got some answers from county leaders. There have been several clusters in western New York. Uh, there was a steel plant in Erie County, uh, a food processing factory. Chautauqua County officials confirmed that the food processing plant Governor Cuomo was referring to is Fieldbrook Foods in Dunkirk. They said of the 31 active COVID cases in the county, 22 are related to that plant alone. When did the Department of Health become aware of the potential cluster at Fieldbrook Farm? We received report of our of the first case related to there on Sunday, August 16th. Uh, so we've been monitoring the situation there since then. The Chautauqua County Department of Health says since March, 30 people associated with Fieldbrook Foods have tested positive for COVID-19. Of those who have tested positive, 24 were employees. Six people were close contacts of those infected. Wells Enterprises, which owns the plant, released a statement saying in part, we have been monitoring the COVID-19 situation closely with our team members, health and safety, our number one priority. Approximately 4% of the employees at our Dunkirk, New York manufacturing facility have tested positive since COVID-19 began. In response, the Department of Health will begin testing there. My public health staff will be conducting a COVID-19 testing clinic for Fieldbrook Foods workforce. This partnership really enables expedited testing and analysis for the people who work there. Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.